Hey folks, it's Rob, and this is Goddess Beta 1.3.1. And uh, we'll see how this goes. Apparently it's about 41% complete feature-wise. So there's still a lot of game to still be implemented. <clears throat> so remember, this is early access. This is basically still alpha land. Um... Me and Peter Molyneux have had, uh... Well, it's not like Peter's had a relationship with me, but I've had a relationship with him. I've played plenty of his games over time, and... I'll be frank, the man makes a lot of promises. <clears throat> right, so, what we got here? I got two guys hammering rocks. Okay. Nothing about what I'm supposed to do. Currently, we're in a windowed mode. I can go to full screen, which will probably break the recording. So what am I doing? All right, I clicked on some guys and they went blink. Wow. Okay. I guess I helped them by breaking the rock. Okay, so now they start to believe in me. This book contains the history of your people. It starts with two lonely souls in the wilderness, ends with the conquest of space. Well, that sounds good. To advance your people, you will need to collect advance cards. Without advance cards, your civilization will not be able to progress. Advance cards can sometimes be made up of element cards found in the world. In the first stage, your advances will be gained through increasing your population. Okay. So, primitive age, establishment. There's our first card. At the start of the primitive age, the followers have moved from the wilderness and have started to come together to live in permanent abodes. By using the basic tools, forming simple communities, and expanding their population, the followers can become even more advanced. Alright. And this looks like stuff we can get. Is there more I'm supposed to click through on here? Well, that looks like all the periods out that way, so I'm gonna just not continue clicking on that. Um, what does this five mean? So, as you can see, this is a first impressions. I've actually had Goddess in my uh, install for a couple weeks. And... I wasn't sure what to do with it. Whether I actually wanted to start messing with this or not. As your followers believe in you, your influence across the land will grow. Okay, so that goes in my collection. Alright. What does it do? No idea. Hopefully we'll learn. Yep. Now, I have played the original Populous. Way back when great! I really enjoyed the original Populous. 
There was one where you had um, Greek gods. That one was okay, too. Um, played black and white. Was a real big looking forward to fan of black and white. And of course, that didn't exactly go as planned. Uh, there's a whole ongoing tale of me enjoying and not quite enjoying Peter Molyneux's games. Because Peter makes a lot of promises that don't necessarily happen. I'm certain you'll have played a game of his at some point, like Fable, or Black and White, or Populous, or something. And, honestly, ever since the modern age of internet, he's, uh... He's been quite good at uh, hyping himself in advance of things, and, you know, his projects, but, uh... How do I move the screen? Okay, mouse keys. No, no, I mean, uh, keyboard keys. All right. And WASD or arrow. Okay. All right, so... Can I... Yeah, I can move that back. Yeah. I hear a heart beating. I don't know what that's about. As you can see, this is not exactly precise. wheel zooms in and out. Okay. Smart sculpting. Double click left and right mouse buttons will push and pull larger areas of land. Right. Okay. First off, we'll clear out the rocks. Back in the original days of Populous, building this close to the sea level was just begging for your, your opponent to flood you and kill you. Okay? Being way down here on the water's edge was a terrible, terrible idea. And a good way to get a whole bunch of your people dead. It makes little rubber band noises. Take my view. Q and E doesn't do that. Holding down right click doesn't allow me to pivot. Holding down the mouse wheel allows me to drag. Okay. Not okay, so I guess I don't can't pivot. This some of this would be better from a different angle, I'm thinking.
Okay, so I gotta set these people up to yeah. working. expansion card. Construction. That's a resource. Unlock that. Do I want them to not generate belief, though? I mean Settle. Yeah, lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of clicking. I could be okay with that if this goes somewhere.
Alright, I'm out of belief. Now what? Our land expansion card. Your followers want to get to the mainland. Well, fair enough. I want them to get there too. Of course, I have no belief. And if they have no belief, what am I supposed to do about that? No one's going anywhere until we get some belief. Seriously. Okay, the trees are stuff I have to knock down. Okay. Suddenly you all believe again. Whatever. God damn it. So this is frustrating. No! God damn it! Okay. When I clear the goddamn rock, what happens now? I don't clear the rock. There's that heartbeat again. I don't. Okay. Our land expansion card. Commandments. To unlock. I need two of something and two of something. Okay. Which 
we can build permanent abodes and they will generate belief. Well, that's good. Bring my rubber band over this way. Go build that house. It's a nicer looking house. if I could remember which way that goes. Not exactly intuitive, the movement system. I mean, the keyboard's fine, but if you don't want to be using the keyboard... The mouse controls are not brilliant. But maybe they could be rebound, I don't know. I haven't looked. Alright, you. Go out and settle some more. No. Get out there. Go. Okay. I can't send you out. Alright. How about you? Will you go out? No. Knock down trees for belief. Look, I'm the mighty tree-felling god. Ooh. Believe in me as I knock down trees. Now, will you go out? Thank you. It cost me belief to send you out. I see. these people. Yo. Um, tell me again why a house doesn't fit here.
little bit of graphical glitchiness involved at some points here. Narrow land expansion card. Okay. What is that? I have no idea. I can't do anything to it at the moment. You go out and sell. No, I can't send you. And you guys won't go. Okay. The tree felling god returns. And look, I destroy rocks. I'm mighty. Mighty. Quake and tremble before me as I knock down trees and rocks. Now you go settle that space. out there and settle. What does this do? Mm, looks like he's building it. Okay. You go settle something yeah. else. doing? More timber. Found at the bottom of the ocean. Nice.
out there and work. I'm guessing that's belief. free will of your followers by a placing a totem. When it's active, all your people will be compelled to approach it. Okay. Yes, build those houses. See nothing for speeding up or slowing down time. Break the house. So how do I get rid of these, like, felt tents that I don't need anymore? Her God.
that. Looks like there's something there, and something here. Expansion card. We continue to move. More stone. Apparently, I need. Telling me you can't get up over here. That you just look at this and go, oh, I can't handle it.
Just give me mana. There, freaking set of stairs, get up there. Move it. Go. Losers. Get moving. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Won't, that won't do, will it? Won't do. Fuck you all. This is frustrating. Mm -hmm. Wake up. And you.
Seriously. There. What does that do? It's like a wolf. I'm, I don't know. You didn't suck so bad, you would have settled somewhere. That's right, your god thinks you suck. And I'm one who keeps knocking and knocking, or crashing into people's houses. Tree powered god. I don't need your stupid belief to keep me going. I have nature to destroy. I could make an interesting landscape look completely bland and uninteresting. Bah ha 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 ha. Bow before me. Now. You think that'd be big enough for a settlement to be on, to be on it? I don't know. I hear some tell it this gets much better later. I'm thinking it's gonna have to be a lot later. Now, I have major issues with the control interface. Yeah. Go, settle that. That, right there. Yeah, you can claim one level, huh? Okay. Fabulous. You, help him build that house. No, you're just gonna stand there. Okay, fine. I have to move each and every layer. I can't just go and double click that one. No, because it does that. Ah. Uh -huh. So annoying. Click and 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 click. Oh my god. And then he dies. <sighs> <laughs> 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 
And then I'm out of power again. Because of course I am. You know it's not working when you don't want to play anymore, you know? I'm only carrying on just to see if we can get something a little more interesting. The other flint I need? Yeah. So, settlements. Place a settlement on any plot or abode, and a town square will be created in which connect all abodes by road. Plea from all abodes will now collect in the town, which is convenient. <sighs> okay. So what do I need to do that? I need 2,000 to get a settlement. Okay. All the trees go down. Complete deforestation. I'm sorry, wolf, but you're going to be a savannah cr creature now. trees I can get to. Would appear so. Alright. Nothing else I can do except wait, I guess. shouldn't be spending my resources. But my god, it's just boring sitting here just staring at this damn thing. Thank you. Yeah. You both can go settle. Yeah. Okay? Even in windowed mode. Here I am pulled all the way back. It's only simulating this, like, small slice. Uh, this isn't... I know it's not done. It's not done, Rob. It's early. But who thought this is great gameplay? Peter. Yeah, I'm just loving the whole sitting around waiting for something to happen aspect. Let's get my cards. Three advance until expansion period.
Really? Really? These are my commandments? And what does this do? Nothing. no shop. Congratulations. Then why have that? Because you're going to have a shop. Great. But I want to see a shop in my simulation game. Just like in SimCity 2. Who doesn't love that? For the love of God. Give me something to do. I need to save up another thousand so I can get a settlement so I can just collect stuff without having to click all over the damn place. Come on! Believe in me! Oh, I'm losing the will to live. I mean, there are no more trees for me to obtain. I already achieved complete deforestation. Don't know what that is. Guess it's some kind of temple or something. You think I know what that is, since we had one before, but I still don't know what it is. Oh, good. blown 400 of my freaking belief just dicking around so yeah can't really say go out and buy this right now Not really feeling it. Maybe come back in a couple of years when it's feature complete, huh? If that ever happens. Because I know you, Peter. Peter Molyneux. How many times have I bought games under the premise that you're going to do things that never, ever, ever happen? Alright, I've had enough. Thank you for watching, folks. Who knows, we might be back to Goddess if there's an update sometime in the future. It makes me think this would be worth doing. But right now, I think I'd rather sho shove my eyeballs out with a pencil. So, have a great day. Goodbye.